Um, today we're just talking about a brand new antenna that Pointing just released. It's called the MIMA 1 in terms of its product name, but we call it the 5-in-1 antenna and quite a unique product. Um, this is a product for machine-to-machine -machine communication using LTE, Wi-Fi and it's also got a GPS ability. First thing that we've done really nicely is the brochure here is uh, quite a complete and comprehensive instruction on how to put it up and where to put it up. Um, so mainly done, the, the normal version, which I will just extract like this, um, is made for mounting on any kind of um, surface using of course this nut, it's got a very nice seal which will adapt to the sort of irregularities of the surface. And as you can see, I've got five connectors, um, two of them for the two LTE antennas inside there, two for the two Wi-Fi antennas and one for a GPS antenna in here. Now there are some other antennas uh, like this. What is unique about this one? The first one is that the LTE antennas cover everything you can possibly hope it to cover. Six, uh, almost 690 megahertz um, up to 960, the bottom part, and then 1700 to 2.7 gigahertz. Okay, so all of the possible bands that you may use for LTE. It's proper MIMO, of course, two antennas. What is unique is that the antennas are low gain. Remember that high gain is a swear word in omni antennas because it means the thing is not omni. In this case, the two antennas are fairly omni. It will never be properly omni with all of this inside this um, box. But they also oriented that if this one is oriented like this, this one will be 90 degree out of phase. So firstly, it gives you space diversity for MIMO applications, but also pattern diversity. So the patterns will fill each other in and hopefully get you more decorrelated parts and at the least will get you a better omnidirectional pattern if the signal is coming from, from somewhere where there's a bit of a null. Then there's the two Wi-Fi antennas, 2.4 and 5 gigahertz. So uh, very nice, uh, again MIMO, again arranged so that they're complementary in terms of their radiation patterns. The other unique part is that it's got a GPS antenna that we've tested I think up down to minus 40 degrees Celsius and up to about 60 or 70 degrees Celsius. Um, and not all GPS units, we tested quite a few that just failed under those low temperature conditions. This is for cash machines and many other applications and one of the first antennas that will give you proper LTE MIMO performance at all bands and using a single enclosure, Wi-Fi and GPS and extremely tough enclosure so it will withstand the bumps and knocks of life.